Oh yeah, can you help me replace that clock later? Your father bought a new one, but we know he's not gonna get around to putting it up there. Yeah, I got you, Mom. Ooh, yes, sir. So you know what you're gonna say? It's pops. Yeah. <laughs> what, that's not a dumb question. I mean, it's a lot of people in there to talk to, Ma. It's not just about him. Mm, if you say so. Ma, it's not. Okay. <sighs> Come on. Have them collars. I'm hungry. This food look amazing. Oh. Good job. Thank you. Good job. Dear Heavenly Father, thank you for bringing this family together in its entirety. Thank you for the blessings that you have brought upon us. Can I say something? Of course, baby. Uh, <clears throat> first off, I just want to say um, thank you all for, for being here. You know, I, I know it's been a while and I kind of forgot what all feels like. I mean, I'm pretty sure y'all know I'm not the best at expressing myself, but um, I love y'all. And I've learned a lot through the years because, uh, well, because y'all taught me a lot. For example, Nalda, you always stay true to yourself, and I, and I always admired that about you. And, and, and Nicole, you taught me so much before the college degrees. You taught me about my blackness and all the black heroes. <coughs> uh, can you pass the salt, Kobe? Curtis, I just. I, I just got a few more things. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Let me go ahead and stop you right there because you said enough. You've been gone for 10 years, right? You didn't have anything to say for 10 years. So why do you want to talk now? You think you can just randomly show up, interrupt my dinner, and talk this bullshit? Look, it's not like I just left for no apparent reason. Oh, so tell me then, why did you leave? You were never around. I'm not supposed to be around. I'm supposed to put food on the table. What? Go on. Name something else since you want to come here and uh, bash I, I ain't you. coming to bash oh, Why are you here? Let me talk! I was hurt. And mad. I mean, you had two jobs and I thought you'd rather be anywhere in the world than be here with your own son. And he was always on me about something. Like, like dishes, homework, 
sports grades. It didn't matter. It was always argue, 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 and I never got the tiniest bit of love. I ain't getting no. I love you, son. I ain't getting no hug. And I sure as hell ain't getting no. I'm, I'm proud of you. So I got mad and I left. I didn't want to be like you so much, I uh, ended up being just like you. I was hard on you because I love you. We are playing a different game, son. I get that now. And I know it's not the parenting that I wanted or how I will do. But I realized you're doing the best you could. So no, I ain't coming to bash you, Pops. I came in to tell you that I don't hate you anymore. But I love you. And because of you, I can be a great father to my kid. And that's the greatest gift I could ever ask for. So guys, I want to introduce you guys to Lisa and Apollo. No way. What? Oh, oh my goodness. <laughs> you have a baby? I have a baby. Is that even <laughs> legal? <laughs> my boy, no. Wow. How fun is it to put me down? Oh my goodness, he's so cute. <laughs> so cool. All these years, and you still don't know how to use soap, right? I'm trying my best, man. Bobby, come on, man. Soap on there. Hey, what's up, Bobby? That's a lot. What's up? What's up? Okay. Right back. Right. 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 Thank you.